Welcome back to the Pursuit of Accuracy. I'm Josh, and today we have something a little bit different for you. That's right, it's a 1022 pattern rifle. This is the Kid Super Grade. Now, this is a fully built, highly accurate 1022. I've never owned one of these, I had one of these on the channel, and I built a ton of 1022s in the past. I just finally decided to make the leap and go ahead and get one of these. Now, we'll talk a little bit more about this in detail later. But in full transparency, I shot this video yesterday, but this camera right here didn't record any audio whatsoever. So instead of boring you with a silent video, I'm going to loop in the groups we shot yesterday. Those were shot using SK long range match. So as you're watching these, you're going to see these first two groups are just kind of bad. Um, I'm shooting the gun in. This is like the first 50 rounds out of the gun. I try to mix batch of ammo and then the gun starts shooting. You're going to see the next three groups there are pretty freaking phenomenal. The last group that's on target number 10, that's actually one I kind of shot rapid fire. So I'm going to play that one in real time so you guys get an idea how quick I was shooting that group. And we played around a little bit on the KYL. I'm not going to bore you with any of that. We're going to see how this does at 52 yards on an ARA target. We're going to shoot some groups. We kind of already know what this will do. Um, we saw the groups from yesterday. Just want to see if that's somewhat repeatable so i'm going to shoot the first 10 out of this pretty quick i don't think it's going to be real great as it's kind of getting that old lube out all right next row down Pretty good. All right, that was one freaking hole. Don't really know how much we're gonna get any better than the last group. It's just pretty freaking good. I'm gonna go ahead and make a little adjustment here. See if we can get more central on that target. right and i'm gonna be playing these all real time which is not something i normally do but because this is a semi-auto i really want you guys to see how fast i'm shooting this for groups how easy this rifle is to shoot for groups had one come out there at the end but that's going to be a pretty freaking good five group average especially considering the fact that we were coming off of a different lubrication ammo into another one for the first you know five and then it just started shooting and because this is my channel, it would not be complete if we didn't take a stab out there at the KYL. So we're gonna do a couple of quick runs and see what we can do. This will be real time. I'm not gonna try and do it super fast on the first one. Uh, we may try and speed it up a little bit as we get going. Wind has picked up a little bit out there. That's uh, 94 yards. Got the camera on it down there. Let's see if we hit. Oh, yeah. Hit one and it ran into the other one. Alright, we're skipping that guy. Oh, off right. There we go. A little bit of wind. Ooh, there it is. 
Go back to the second one if we got a round. Nope. All right. Holding a little bit of wind, dancing around on us, but we were able to use the 10 rounds to get through the 50 yard KYL at 94 yards, pretty good. Kind of our measure of success around here. Um, let's see if we can get through it clean. That's what I really like to do. All right, here we go. Oh, that's eight shots, eight hits, 94 yards, 50 yard KYL target. So that's a two inch down a quarter inch. And uh, did it eight for eight, pretty quick. Uh, not a whole lot. Let's see if we can get lucky and hit that quarter again. There it is again. I mean, out of a 1022, I understand these are, you know, premium price. They're, they're not cheap. You get a really good kid trigger with it. This one's a single stage. They offer a two stage. I prefer single stage. Um, quite honestly, it's getting switched out for a Calvin Elite, not because the trigger is not good, because the Calvin Elite has adjustable, like kind of swappable trigger shoes, and I want that flat one. So last shot of the day here. Hopefully it's not a whiff. Quarter inch again. There it is again. So we went eight for eight down the rack. We hit the quarter inch a uh, second time and a third time. So, all right guys, so there you have it. The Kids Supergrade 1022 and man, does it live up to the name of Supergrade. This is the most accurate 1022 I probably ever shot in my entire life. It is spendy, you know, it's up there around a couple thousand dollars like we talked about in there. But if you're looking for a rifle that can do everything, you could shoot this at a PRS NRL 22 match. You could hunt with this. It's not crazy heavy. You can just plank with it. You can do everything with this. The only thing I might not do is try and shoot this in like a two gun rimfire. For all practical concerns, you know, you could buy three or four 1022s. You could put barrels on them. You could do these, or you could just buy one. That's going to be really, really amazingly accurate. Out there at 50 yards, we're shooting 0.2 to 0.3s. It's clearing the KYL rack at 94 yards. That is something that is kind of measure success for bolt guns, uh, let alone a semi-auto like this to be able to do that and do it the way it just did it on camera is pretty freaking impressive. So tip of the iceberg, we're gonna get into a lot more testing. We're gonna push the range out on this a whole lot further. So hopefully you guys stick around for that. And if you're a 1022 fan or your buddies are, make sure you share this video, like it, so we can get it out there to as many people as possible. I appreciate your guys' support. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next one.